Hello and welcome. Today I show you how easy it is to prevent your laptop or desktop computer, a Windows 10 computer, from going to sleep while you want it to stay on. This could be useful if you want to leave your computer on overnight to do some task and you want to be sure 100% that it will not power off unless the power is cut. But uh, this is another story. The thing that you can do to prevent your computer from standing going to standby is very easy. You can uh, you go to start menu and here you either uh, search for settings. This is settings and then you make a search here, but I'm going to show you directly from the start menu how to do it. So in the start menu, you just type power because you you want to know about power options. So you have power and sleep settings. Click on that. And I believe you already know what to do in this screen. I will just give you a few seconds to look at it. The hardest part is to know how to get to the screen. So to get to it, you just type power because you remember it's power related. And when you when you're here, you have to decide how much time you want the screen to be on and when you want the computer to go to sleep after. So in this one is 10 minutes to turn off the screen and never to sleep. But yours might be 30 minutes. It could be like this. If you want the screen to be also on, you could change this to never if you want. But actually, you don't really need the screen to be always on. But for some reason, if you want that, here you can customize it to whatever setting you like. You can make it turn off after one hour, never, or you can leave it after 15 minutes. And because the screen consumes more power than uh, than you need, and if you want to leave the computer on overnight, you use the sleep setting here to change it from one hour or 30 minutes to never. But if you want your computer to stay on all the time, if you're watching something or you're not sure for whatever reason, you could have it for both of them, never. This is up to you, it's your personal preference here. If you want to change more settings, uh, you can check additional power settings and here you have the power plans. Um, balance is the default plan and this is now, you see, it's never and never. And you can go into advanced power settings and even even further you can uh, in this plan you can change the setting for the hard disk if you want the hard disk to turn off after more minutes than 20 minutes you can uh, you can change that but uh, no need to go into too much details on uh, which settings you change here you could basically choose high performance if you want to use the maximum efficiency uh, maximum power of your computer or power saver if you want to reduce electricity use so if if i'm going to go back to here and i choose the power saver plan you see it turns off the screen after five minutes and computer goes to sleep after 15 so if you you're away from the computer for 15 minutes it goes into sleep mode when you come back you can wake it up and it's like you left it there but it could happen that it doesn't wake up and you have to reset it Sometimes it could happen, but rarely. So balanced is the recommended one and it, you see it keeps the changes you made. If you want to change these settings, remember, and you don't need to save anything, it's all saved once you, once you do that. But remember just uh, power. You type power and here in the power and sleep settings, you have, uh, you have your options. I'm gonna put them back to 15 minutes and one hour because it's how I, maybe 10 minutes, how I have them now. But this is your preference. So that's how you do it. And there is no save option, like I said, you just close the window and it's fine. Thanks for watching and I hope this video is helpful. And if it does, let me know in the comment section below how you did it and what is your preference for power for the screen and for the sleep mode. I'm really curious about this, how people prefer to have this power. Remember, the shorter the time for the sleep mode and the screen, the lower amount of time, the minutes, the more energy efficient your computer will be and you will save money on the power bill 
and you will be a little bit more uh, environment friendly by doing that. So if you really want to have your computer on for uh, two hours, maybe put it on for two hours. Not don't say to never or one hour. See, just increase it a little bit, not too much. Thanks for watching and I hope this video is helpful. And if it does help you, let me know in the comment section below and share the video with your friends. Tell them about our channel and share this video. Let them know that uh, they can do this. Subscribe, like and share and I will see you next time. Bye. Give a thumbs up.